the information for the black nation for liberation. So without no further ado, let's bring the brother on.
Grace and peace, family. Grace and peace. And so I want you to listen very carefully. I'm going to be um, modifying certain words um, so that it makes us less likely to be targeted uh, by the powers that shouldn't be. Somebody talk black to me. Now, what are we discussing today? What news am I breaking today and why is this important? For those of you um, that have been keeping up with what's going on in the world, you all understand that there uh, has been an unprecedented and disproportionate um, targeting of black people for the cocoa and for the vacation. Talk black to me. <laughs> and while we here as intelligent black people acknowledge that this emergency is real, we don't do conspiracy theories. Uh, beloved, I always let folks know that I'm not an attorney. I'm not giving legal advice. I always give a disclaimer to let you all know to do your own research. And listen to some uh, news earlier today. I was so blessed to take a brief walk and was getting myself together and prepared for the day. And I just noticed um, that uh, one of the MSNBC's reporters, Craig Melvin, came on. And he briefly, in, in a suspect manner, said breaking news. The View, Sonny Hostin, and Anna Navarro, in preparation for a live interview they're supposed to be having with Kamala Scamala Harris, had to be spirited off the set because mid-show, they tested positive for that cop cop. Talk black to me. So Joy Behar and them had to flip the script and start talking, taking live questions from the audience while they spirited Sonny and Anna off. Now, why we're bringing this news to you, family, is that we constantly, we keep seeing high-profile people who are fully vacationed. Let me say that again. What's making this interesting is these highly visible, fully vacationed individuals who were pushing the juices on us This is not a one-off family. This is not an accident. This is not a, 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 an aberration. This is not the exception to the rule. We are seeing that something is going on with the folk who are fully vacation. The very people who are demanding mandates on us, telling us that we're the problem you all's own scientists, do your research family, are, are admitting that you getting the vacation neither prevents you from getting cocoa nor spreading cocoa. Greetings. This is Elder Blacklight. Do y'all remember Celebrity Apprentice Reality TV Donald Trump was the king on the hill on that show This conditioned you for uh, What's going on now To Huckabay Polite Inky Sinetta uh, Kev Gills. I don't know how this brother, Kev Gills, Coffee and Kush, how he get to be a leader. When you light up a joint, don't let your children watch that. Anyway, these brothers, I believe all of them is down with the government some kind of way. Because how can you lead your people off a cliff if you ain't getting paid for it? So why you ain't banging on the beast? You know. See we still on the plantation. Whether or not you want to believe it or not. It's just done uh upgraded itself. 
and they used the whip back in the day on the plantation to control us. Now they're using uh, TV along with, uh, how the sisters say, the vacation. Scared to say to say the real name because she want to get a message across to us and don't want to get uh, took down. But yet and still, Morris World TV, they get they get the most views. Side there to get a, get a lot of views, and others that's on that tag team slinging mud YouTube uh, sensationalism that our people subscribe to. But I'm a little different. You know, because I don't take comments. I don't ask for your money. And I don't have nothing to lose. So, you do though, because I'm going to tell you the, the real deal. And how to beat the system. How to beat the devil. There's many ways to skin a cat. There's more ways to skin a cat than one. You know, you don't need a gun all the time. See, your mind created the created the gun. The mind creates the weapon. I mean, we had guns a long time ago, way before the Caucasian had guns. We didn't use them the same way the Caucasian used them. We had black powder, you know, gunpowder and all that to make firecrackers. But we didn't use them for blowing up people, you know. See, we had a, diff a, a different culture. This is Black Light. Stay tuned for part two of this. Peace.